How does it feel you're at a away game and you see all hey, these fans? Hey. Come on, Pete. It's nothing like this Steeler Nation, baby. They show up wherever we play. And I got to ask you, why did you decide to sign here when you... This, <laughs> the Story franchise always have great defensive players. Mike Tomlin. I mean, Mike Tomlin. I mean, I would not rather be anywhere else. This is where I wanted to be just because of the fans. They travel well and just how well the defense is played year in and year out. I had to be a part of this. I'd love to ask you about that. You played on some great defenses, played for some great defensive coaches, but what is it like to play for Mike Tomlin? Man, Coach Tomlin is different, man. He eats, sleep, and breathes football. <laughs> he really does. It's, every day we have our separate meetings with the older guys. We have our winning edge meetings. We're always trying to find something that's going to give us that edge to win the ball game, and that we did today. And this was a back and forth game for a minute. Can yep. you walk us through your interception? What happened on that play? <laughs> yeah, on the interception, it was a uh, it was a broken play. I think they ran a star concept. Uh, uh, Jama uh, Jacoby Myers ran a um, there it is. Yeah, he tried to run like a, uh, run like a little stop route. End up running, uh, scrambling. He threw it up for grabs and P2 there for the pick, baby. Uh, how, how nice is it having those guys come off the edge, man? T.J. Hey, Watt, Alex Highsmith. These, this is the best pass rushing group that I've been around. Like. Mm. When you have two guys that can consistently beat guys, when you have guys coming in to back them up that can do the same thing, we can be very special. Yeah. Talking to the coaches before the game, you know, the whole emphasis was on stopping the run, not letting Josh Jacobs get going. Walk us through that, what your meetings were like this week. Well, you know, first two weeks, you know, we, 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 we haven't been as good as we wanted to be in the, in the rushing department. And we knew Josh Jacob had a bad game last week. They're going to try to feed him a little bit. And we knew that was going to be a point of emphasis of those guys trying to get him the ball early and often. So this week, our point of emphasis was stop the run. Force those guys to throw the ball down the field on us. They got a couple shots, but we kept them out of the end zone. And Monday, you got three picks. Exactly. <laughs> hey, Pat, Monday night football, very physical game. You mm -hmm. come back, you make a West Coast trip. Yep. What does it say about this team that you're able to recover, come down here, and play with such energy? We're gritty. We're a gritty football team. And we just play, we love to play bully ball. We're going to play a lot of bully ball throughout this season. We're going to run the ball. We're going to beat you up on defense, put your quarterback on the ground, and see what happens. Defensively, do you feel like you have to do more because of the offense was kind of a little inconsistent? No, not really. Just as long as we do our part, you know, as long as we keep teams out of the end zone, keep the game close, you know, not let the game get out of hand, and hopefully the offense will get it going sooner or later. And you've had this long, amazing career now, but how is your perspective, your appreciation for playing this game, how is it now at this point in your career? Man, I'm having so much fun at this at this point in my career because I feel like my wife, she texts me every single day, <laughs> have fun. Don't, don't put so much stress on yourself and going out there trying to make every play. Have fun, be where you're supposed to be, and it'll come to you. Yeah, because so, you gave up two touchdowns last week. I know. I, 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 <laughs> you think I was going to mention that? You I made know. Up for it. I made up for it. I got, I got my first pick here today. <laughs> Walk us through Adam's first touchdown. It looked like you were trying to come off. Did you think you were going to yeah, make that a, play? Replace the free so, safety. Yes, I was replacing the free safety because Jacoby Myers ran the over route. Yep. So Mika came out of the middle of the field. So I had to go. I got to run directly to the, to the middle of the field to the post. And as soon as I look back, these legs are kind of weird, man. You know I, lost the I ball. thought you lost the yeah, ball because I, I ball. said, Patrick Coach, Peterson that's why usually he plays makes corner. That he doesn't play no, safety. No, no, no. He usually makes Coach. those plays on the ball. <laughs> You're right, Coach. <laughs> <laughs> I got to ask, what, 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 what have you seen from Kenny Pickett that's impressed you since you've been there? Man, just his poise, his ability to, to, to keep the guys in the game, keep the guys focused on the task at hand. And He's just a winner, man. I mean, I know first week wasn't a great outing. Last week probably wasn't a great outing. But W's, that's all that matters for us, man. We want to get W's. And speaking of that, Coach Tomlin talks about stacking wins. I know he challenged you guys. We got to stack some. Yep. What, what does this mean tonight? This is our first opportunity to stack one. And that we did on a West Coast road trip against a, a, a AFC, a, a AFC opponent. You always want to have a get an opportunity to get a leg up on an AFC opponent. but. It was a great team win from all phases of the game, special teams, defense, and offense. Yeah, how about Presley, the last man? Bomb? That was a bomb. <laughs> when you you talking about that punt? Yeah. Yes. Oh, that was unbelievable. That man. was awesome. What a that, weapon. That speaks to your team, though. The plays that you have to make when you need a guy to step up and make a big play, you're making them. Yep, and that's, and that's all we do each and every day in practice. And Coach does a great job of 
starting the day off with a competition period. Hey, last one for you. What was the mood, that locker room you just walked into there for just a second? What was the mood? What was the mood? Oh, man, we was playing a song called Walking Your Trap, Take Over Your Trap. Oh, I know that one. <laughs> mm. You know that one, Harry? Hey, when is Louis Vuitton? <laughs> Slip us on. He's my shower shoes. Well deserved, brother, man. Thank you. We well, go get yourself you. a good shower. All about Have a great you, flight back home. We got a little sound after the game. Mike Tomlin, one of the greatest, maybe in the history of the league, as a head coach stepping up to the microphone. We heard so much great sound from him this week. We got to listen in. Our thanks to P2 for coming out and hanging out.